If you're looking for a fun adventure this summer, Seven Valleys Borough might have something for you. Fox 43's Robert Stover took a ride with American Rail Bike Adventures and shares how this company is peddling in popularity. Now that more rail's not being used, I think it's going to get more popular. It's not quite a tandem bicycle, but it's on the right track. It's pretty much just like a bicycle that you're at home, except there's no steering and no passing, you know. But yeah, it's all individually pedaled. The rail bikes are fitted to existing railroad tracks and can carry a group of four cyclists. Each tour can hold up to 20 riders. And while biking the rails isn't a new outdoor activity, more and more tours are opening around the Commonwealth. This is our second year, yep. We've been in Sewerstown for three years now, and this is our second year here. Zane says the bikes are just as fun and just as challenging as traditional bikes, but rail biking is less competitive. It's not geared towards speed, it's leisure. It's comparable to like third gear on a 10 speed. It's just a leisure ride, it takes a couple hours to get down to the tunnel and back. Using existing rail tracks is also giving railroads new purpose. A lot of places they don't um, they don't have anything going on with the rail at all anymore. Once they decommission the trains, they just don't want any any use of uh, on them at all. Tours in Seven Valleys and Stewartstown will continue until November 2023. You can make riding reservations using the link on fox43.com. Robert Stover, Fox 43 News. That's a really cool use of some old yeah. tracks hey, out there. I'm glad he showed us how to get back. I know. Like, how do they get back? <laughs> well, you turn it around and go Delete. back the other way. Yeah, do a little spin, cool. yeah. yeah.